we are here with the babies and MJ. Who's not smiling? Give us, give us, a, give us a smile. Mm. And it is theme Thursday. Animal print and Winnie the Pooh. Pooh bear. Ah, uh, Pooh bear. It's a jolly good bear. I love Pooh bear. My first son, his nursery, his bedding and everything for his um, room was Winnie the Pooh. And I had this cute, cute Pooh and Tigger stuffed animals that sang. And I don't know. I think they're gone. I don't know. They might be in all my stuff somewhere. But they are so cute. And I wish I still knew where they were because I would have pulled them out. But anyway, on to the babies. Here they are. And if you notice, we have our my work in progress girl here. Um, whose name we're not going to say yet. Actually, she doesn't look too bad through the camera right now. <laughs> I'm a little discouraged. It's my first time and I'm kind of a perfectionist. And actually she looks she doesn't look too bad. She looks a little a little yellow, but um yeah, MJ loves her already. Um and she looks like she's got lipstick on, but yeah. Mm -hmm. I had definitely have work to get better. But you know, practice makes perfect, right? Yep. So there she is. Anyways, we'll start from the beginning. So Lily Mae is wearing animal print. She's got the giraffe print looking print on with a elephant on the shirt on the it's a sleeper and she's got the little hat to match and the little hand mittens to match. She's all animal printed out. And then Mr. Max, well, you know, we didn't have any animal print, but he's wearing a onesie with lions on it, which are animals, so that works as an animal print, right? <laughs> That's kind of what we thought. It doesn't really have anything. And then our sweet girl that I'm trying so hard to do here is wearing a Pooh Bear onesie that's actually Lily Mae's, so it's a little big. MJ, stop. I want to so they can see her better. She's fine. I don't want them to see her. So, well, we'll show her when she's all done. But we thought, I thought she I'd just put her to, her. yeah, I might change her a little bit. Um, I thought I'd put her together and let her be a part of our theme Thursday because I knew we had this little onesie of lilies that I wanted to use. I wanted her to be in her animal print, so I thought, well, the new baby can wear the poop bag. Hey, you can wear more than that. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. Let me do a little... Pooh bears on there. They're so cute. Um, much brighter on the camera. And then the star. Huh? They're much brighter on the camera. Yeah. So here and here's Parker in his Halloween costume as Tigger. Oh my gosh. So perfect. And he, you know, he's animal print because he's tiger print, right? And he's Tigger from Winnie the Pooh. Oh my gosh. I just love this on him. Mm -hmm. He is so snuggly, as you can tell. MJ is totally snuggling with him. He still has his pacifier and his elephant lovey, but you know, there he is. Oh my gosh, I gotta get closer to him here. <laughs> Let me have him, MJ. Let me hold him and show you. Oh, look how cute! Mm. I love this so much. She's my baby. Yep. <laughs> So, there he is. Oh, doesn't he look so cute? You can tell he's my favorite baby. But anyways, <laughs> look at that. Oh my gosh, I love it. I think this is going to be your new favorite baby. You think she'll be my favorite when she's completed? She's going to be my new favorite. I already know she's going to be my new favorite. <laughs> she's not perfect, guys, but you know, I'm working. I'm trying. I don't know how to get the... Her to not look so yellow. I mean, in, in person, she doesn't look as yellow as she does on the camera. I don't know. And there's so many people need to say thank you. And, to. like, I don't know, her hands actually don't look too bad. Well, I have a lot of camera. people to thank you on Saturday. <laughs> a lot of people. But anyways, there she is. And here they all are. And they're so cute, as always. And MJ is not wearing animal print. She has animals on her leggings. 
She's got kitty cats on her leggings. <laughs> Can you tell? It's like all scrunched up here. There we go. There's the kitty. And here's the little sleeping princess kitty. Aww. And a unicorn oh. in her shirt. I don't think that counts. Because unicorns aren't, you know, real. But there they are. They're real in my world. They're real in your world. Okay, what did your what was your question of the day? You said you had a question. Oh, I forgot. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what's, what's your question of the day? Have you ever had to be in like an emergency room? Oh. Like have like a really, really bad injury. Did you have <laughs> that's an interesting question. Yes. Most so, people like, have been to the ER at some point in their lives. I know, but like but something really, really that I had. What is it called? Well, MJ had pneumonia when she was four? I was three. Three? That was my first year of preschool. Year four, then. When she was four years old, she got pneumonia. From? She aspirated on, this is kind of gross, sorry. If you're grossed out easily, don't listen. Or turn the video off. But she aspirated on vomit because she got sick with a stomach virus and then aspirated on it, which means it went into her lungs which caused an infection in her lungs, which caused pneumonia in her lungs. I mean, yeah, you know, and it, it's, it was, they called it pneumonia, but it was an infection. Her, le her entire left lung was infected and it was full of fluid. She had fluid around her lung, like the sac that's around the lung was full of fluid. So she ended up being airlifted to a children's hospital in a helicopter. And, um... When, and then me and her dad, um, Nathan. You stayed. We, well, yeah, but we both drove up there, and the rest of the kids stayed with my mom and dad. And we drove up to the hospital, and... Josiah was a little baby, right? Yeah, Josiah was only a baby. And when we got up there, they said they wanted to put a chest tube in to drain the fluid around her lungs. So they did that. And everything went well, and she got better, and but she was... So With I her time in the hospital here and her time so in the hospital I up there, it was like about three weeks of being in the hospital. So almost a month, like half a month. It was almost, I, it was almost so, a month, yeah, so it was horrible. So pretty much when I got up, it was hard for me to walk because I was in pain. Well, she... Because my back. Her back really hurt, and I knew something was wrong because, you know, MJ never complains. Um, even when she was little, she never really complained about things hurting unless they really, really hurt. So it was... I don't know how we got on this. Oh, you were your question of the day. Have yes. you ever been to the ER? <laughs> so, yes. MJ's been in the ER with something serious my dad before. She has, couldn't breathe. My dad has had tons. Well, yeah, I've never had to go to the ER for anything too serious. ER. Have I can't you think of anything. Been, have you had hurt something like that? No. I've never had oh, stitches. I fell, you, I fell into a nail one yeah. time. On your knee, but you didn't go to the ER. So tell us your story. Everybody has a story, right? About how if, they seriously want, injured themselves. <laughs> Feel free to, to share in the comments, but you don't have to if you don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> now that you've gotten to know like all of MJ's lovely, harrowing story of what else being in the my, ER. Nothing else really bad happened to me. Yep. Yeah, nothing bad has happened to me probably because... I'm a gymnast, and... And you're cautious. You've yeah, always been I, cautious I always your whole catch, life. I always catch myself. Like, if I know I can't do something, I don't do it. Yeah. That's you what I said. You're cautious. how much bruises I had from catching myself falling. <laughs> okay. All right. This video's gotten long enough. <laughs> All right. Okay. And put your legs down. And MJ says, bye. bye.